Good morning everyone, hope you're all doing well. Please ignore my like crazy random hair start right now. I am planning on straightening my hair at some point today. That's because I washed it and let it dry crazy yesterday. That's why it's currently looking like this. But yeah, I will sort that out at some point. I've woken up like quite early this morning and it's a Sunday. So I don't really know why I was up so early. I woke up about eight, it's now 29. So I've just sorted all the puppies out, giving them their breakfast stuff. Had another bit of a flooding situation in the carry again this morning, but not as bad as the last few times, so it was alright, it was quickly cleaned up. But look, see the sun is still still in the process of rising. It's just coming up over there right now. That would actually make quite a nice picture. I might get a picture of that. But yeah, I don't know why I was up so early, but then I heard the puppies crying and no one else was up yet, so I thought I might as well just come down and see what's going on with them. I'm quite excited for breakfast this morning as well, because I've got my... Um, overnight oats pot to try and I've never tried overnight oats but I've really wanted to for a long time which I made yesterday so hopefully that's all good let's see what I'm doing this morning oh look it's in there I can't wait to eat that I'm starting to actually get kind of hungry even though it's still really early but I'll probably get breakfast in a bit I think today I'm planning on just having kind of a I feel like just having a chilled very relaxed do nothing kind of day because Every day I seem to have at least just one little thing to do, but I just feel like having a complete, like, chill, nothing to do day. I feel like I haven't done that for a little while, so, yeah, that'll be quite nice to do. I think we are planning on going out for lunch, but besides that, when I say we, I mean me and my parents are uh, thinking of going out for lunch, but besides that, we haven't really got any plans for today, so it would be quite nice to have a chill day. Maybe this afternoon I'll have, like, a bit of a... A pamper session or something. I do feel like doing a face mask at some point because I haven't done that in a long time either. And I've got this mosquito bite at least here has more or less gone down, but this one on my nose has actually started to come up a little bit more. So I don't know if just doing a nice cooling refreshing face mask might help them to go down a bit as well. I'm hoping maybe. So excited to eat this. It's definitely set, like it's no longer moving at all, which is so weird. I've never actually made anything like Besides smoothies with chai seeds, so I didn't know that it would properly like set like a gel type thing. So I can't wait to eat this. I have, oh my god, my hair is literally crazy. I'm about to go try and sort that out, but I've managed to come open the stair gate with one hand. Also, this one hand has got my phone and hard drive in it. We have this here to like stop the dogs going upstairs, but it's like a little button you have to press on this side, and I literally couldn't do it with my hands at all. But yeah, the dogs can't be sleeping anyway. They're all. They're all in there, let's play and sleep. But yeah, I've managed to get the vlog edited and uploaded, like yesterday's vlog. And I'm now gonna head up and actually get a shower and get dressed and sort myself out. And then I will sort my hair out because like I said, I'm going out for lunch and don't really wanna go out with it like this and it needs straightening anyway. I've finally got my hair and makeup and everything all done. So I'm looking and feeling a lot, a lot, a lot more refreshed <laughs> now. I think I'll just quickly, hang on, let me just get into the bath. Room, turn that light on give you a quick OOTD of what I'm wearing just it's very simple but I've got these um gray shorts on from I want to say either Bershka or Pull and Bear I can't remember where I don't know if I can see the label or not let me see if I can see it in the mirror oh I think they're from Bershka okay these are from Bershka I like them because they've got a little bow to tie and they're kind of high waist and they've got like pockets as well and then this little black crop top with like this trim edge like this is from boohoo as well my stomach is looking like oh, so pale <laughs> it honestly makes my arms look so tanned honestly i'm like a multi cut <laughs> but oh well i think i'm gonna go grab some water downstairs now actually because i'm feeling quite thirsty it's always after straightening my hair i think it's probably the heat from the straighteners to be honest that always just chuck up and plug the straight bills. Yeah, okay, that always makes me want water. So, I'm gonna go, go out. Ugh, gonna go down and get a drink. Oh yeah, also I was just gonna say, this lip colour that I've got on is actually one of the new NYX ones I bought a few weeks ago and I did mention it in a whole video I did a little while ago on my channel. It was some point in August, I'm pretty sure. Probably towards the beginning of the month I can't quite remember but I haven't actually got around to wearing it yet I've only done a swatch of it I haven't actually seen it on yet and I quite like it it's quite a good sort of nudie neutral color 
Let me just try and find what I've done with it. I've literally just had it, but oh, there it is. I've got so many like lips, it's just crabbing up in the drawer that it makes it impossible to find one. But it's this one, it's their matte, it's one of their matte um, lipsticks. Hang on, let's try and let it focus on that. There we go. So it's one of their matte lipsticks, yet yeah, by NYX. And this one is in sh the, the shade Sierra, which is number 12, if you want to know what it is, if the camera will focus on it. I don't know if it's going to or not. There we go, it's focused, but it's upside down. There we go, yeah. It's shade Sierra in the number 12. So we are in the car now on our way to go out for some lunch. We're going to this well, I guess, yeah, it's like an Italian restaurant that we've been going to for years, but we haven't been there for a little while, so it'll be nice to go there again and get some food. And also, the weather today is really nice. It's really sunny and warm out, so it'll be quite nice to get out and about out of the house. So we've made it to the restaurant now, and we've just got a starter, having some salad to start. The camera's not even in focus. There we go. Got a big bowl of salad to start. It's all nice and fresh, which is good. Being all healthy to start. I'm getting quite hungry as well now. So our main food has just arrived and now I've got is it either pork or beef? I think it might be pork actually in like a creamy mushroom sauce with rice and potatoes. What have you got dads? Some kind of prawn spaghetti and then my mum's basically got the same as me but in is it a wine sauce? Like a wine kind of sauce but the same thing pretty much just different sauce. So just walking back to the car from the restaurant, I don't know if you just saw, but there was like this giant dog that was like really tall but really thin. I don't know, we don't really know what it was, but I don't know if you can see like how big it actually was on camera, but compared to like the man standing next to it, it was just this like huge dog. You could like literally ride on it. It's so weird, but like really cool as well. We're about to attempt to bath both of these. Oh, where's Bailey gone? He's gone over there seeing what's going on. We haven't yet done that, so it's going to be interesting. Not too sure how they're going to respond to the water. Not too sure how keen they are. They're both, we put Bob's in, he just got straight out. And Bailey's trying to make a bit of an escape now too. You don't like it, Bob's here. <laughs> they're both just rolling around in the grass now, trying to dry themselves. <laughs> They don't really know what's happened. It's a little bit later on now and it's already just gone eight, I wanna say. Yeah, it's like ten past eight now already, so I kinda wanna get some dinner. I'm not really like that hungry as we had like a big meal out earlier, but I do kinda want something and I'm really undecided what to have. I don't know whether to have like fruit and yogurt or hummus and like pepper and cucumber. I'm just so undecided what to have. I know like whichever I choose I'm gonna be wanting the other thing. I think I'm, mm, I might save the yogurts for breakfast. I'm just so undecided, I'm so bad at making decisions that honestly I can literally take forever. You know what, I'm gonna go with hummus and pepper and cucumber right now. And maybe a piece of like the quinoa bread that I have because it's like only small pieces, so maybe a little bit of that. But then I'm kind of feeling like the yogurt, but if I go for yogurt then I'll be wishing I'd chosen the hummus. I literally need help right now deciding. <laughs> it's literally me with every single decision. So I went with the hummus option in the end and I've got some cucumber chopped tops, some red pepper, then a piece of like this quinoa gluten free red as well, just as they were like smaller pieces as well, but I've like taken the chunky end bit which is like really nice to dip in hummus, so that's all good. And then I've got red pepper hummus here and then normal hummus, although this pot's running out. I think I've got a new one in the fridge though, so I'll probably have to get the new one out. I've also just been watching like a couple of episodes of Life of Kylie as I'm quite behind with that. I saw the first two a while ago now and then yeah I think the series is like pretty much done. There's like one more episode to air or something so I've been watching a bit of that as I do love like keeping up with the Kardashians, not gonna lie. So yeah I've been watching some of that. I might watch another episode of it now. It's quite good because I'd say yeah Kylie's probably one of my favourite ones out of the sisters so yeah I've been enjoying watching her series and seeing like her everyday life. There's only five minutes now till X Factor's about to start. I'm happy that's on like Sundays now as well because it used to always just be Saturdays but I don't know if they still have the like live auditions as well as the room auditions because I know at one point they took away the room auditions and just had live auditions and then they brought back 
the room auditions but then also still had live auditions so i don't know if it's still both or whether it's just one that's why they've like doubled up on saturday and sunday so that they've got time to fit in both i'm not really sure but i'm just going to get myself a cup of green tea ready that's why i'm just currently like trying to empty the kettle it's a lot harder to do with one hand though but i'm gonna boil this up get some green tea ready and then settle down to watch x factor i'm just about to get myself ready for bed as i'm feeling pretty sleepy now i'm feeling really tired for some reason even though i've had one of those kind of do nothing days but i actually find that when you have quite a chilled sit around the house day it makes you feel more tired in a way for some reason i never understand that it's just it always happens though but it's been quite nice just to have a chilled day with not much going on i'm gonna end this vlog here as i am just gonna get ready for bed now and get into bed and basically get to sleep i hope you enjoyed today's vlog be sure to smash the thumbs up if you did also click that little red subscribe button down below if you're new and i'll be sure to see you very soon with another vlog night